Following a century of rapid developments, there continues to be a huge appetite for innovation across the oil and gas sector. Chemical breakthroughs at Honeywell UOP have been integral to the development of process technology. Laurie Pinson sent us this from Chicago to see how the Honeywell Connected plant can improve the operation of refineries and petrochemical plants across the globe. UOP is the leading producer of catalysts in the world for high-value applications. Dr. Jeffrey Bricker is the Senior Director of Research at Honeywell UOP and at the forefront of catalyst development, securing 64 patents in the field. One of our biggest breakthroughs is replacing HF and sulfuric acid and alkylation, high octanes. Bricker and his team of scientists are working on process breakthroughs and exploratory research, inventing new materials that place Honeywell UOP as the leader in process technology for the oil and gas sector. What is the role of the catalyst? The catalyst is the core of a process technology. It does the conversion of the feedstock to the products and it adds a lot of value and economic benefit for our customers. So how do your customers benefit from UOP's research and development? Oh, well, they benefit greatly because we develop breakthrough catalysts which allow them to make the highest value from their pro uh, feedstock streams. And for example, natural gas to chemicals would be one example. Honeywell UOP is always innovating and developing new technology. We have new technology fields ongoing right now to convert methane into valuable products. We have opportunities to be able to help our refiners take low value materials which are becoming out of favor, very high sulfur compounds, converting those into very, very useful fuels and chemicals. So we're constantly innovating in the field of chemistry. UOP has been around for 103 years. And we've been critical in the development of almost every refining technology. In fact, 31 of the 36 refining technologies that are used today have been developed by UOP. 60% uh, of the world's gasoline is produced by UOP. Um, and I think uh, of the 700 refiners around the world, we're in all but a handful. We are constantly upgrading our core technologies, which we believe will continue to better the world. So, you know, when it really comes to being that trusted advisor on how our customers are going to, you know, define projects, uh, build projects, take projects forward, we're there from the very beginning and we help them really plan those projects out and execute them. Working with Honeywell, customers benefit from greater reliability and better processing solutions, resulting in yield improvements and more favorable economics. Honeywell Connected Plant is an opportunity for Honeywell technologists to be right alongside the technologists who are operating the plant at our customers' facilities. It's like putting Honeywell inside the control room at one of our facilities. It allows us to be able to see the data, to help uh, analyze the data and to figure out which direction the plant should go for the most optimal performance. Looking toward the future, Honeywell UOP monitors new plants for production quality. Each one of these towers is testing new processes on a refinery that hasn't been built yet. This enables the pilot plant to prove the chemistry, increase efficiency, and reduce energy consumption. Pilot plants are miniaturized versions of full-scale commercial plants. They are absolutely critical to the development of chemical processes because it gives the developers and researchers a full view as to what their process is doing and if it's working as intended. We run 107 pilot plants here at UOP and they are simulating roughly 70 to 80 processes that uh, we commercially sell these days. We see very strong demand as far as as you know, we can uh, forecast for petrochemical products, for plastics. And you know, that's because of this growing middle class, uh, India, China, Southeast Asia, Africa. As their middle class becomes more affluent, has more free cash flow to spend, um, starts to have more children, uh, eat more takeout food, buy more cars, they all have a tremendous plastics content. So we see the future of hydrocarbons and plastic uh, growing 1.7 to 2 times GDP as we look out uh, to the future. 
Our challenge is that the energy density that people use, the intensity of the energy, has to decline in order to have a sustainable environment. So we're working on a wide variety of things from energy storage through to green polymers, through to applications of our technologies and materials in medicine and pharmaceuticals. We have a wide portfolio of activities which really, I think, have the opportunity to propel Honeywell UOP to a leadership position in other industries to complement our leadership position in refining petrochemicals and natural gas. As we look to the future, the you know, capability in the semiconductor and the microchips and the sensors and the cost structure of those today are truly powering digitization. And so we see a really rapid move of uh, our customers and our industry into a digitized environment where things will be connected via the cloud and wireless and the ability to control the units and make adjustments and really leverage um, optimization, reliability, uh, machine learning, big data to drive uh, cleaner uh, environments, cleaner plants, cleaner processes and more fuel efficient and energy efficiency across the board. We think digitization is the next generation, uh, the next revolution, and UOP and uh, Honeywell Process Solutions, our sister business, are combining our efforts to really drive that through our Honeywell Connected plant.